hello friends in this video i will show you how to create a drawable resource file in android studio so here i will create a drawable resource file and set it as background of text view so let's start first we have to go to this resource folder we have to select android here and then go to resource folder in resource folder go to drawable and click on any of the items in drawable then right click and click on new drawable resource file so here you have to name it i will name it as background and click ok so now this is the drawable resource file here i will create a rectangle with rounded corners so i'll name it as shape and we have to select the shape also so in next line i will write android shape rectangle okay and next i will set the gradient in gradient i will set the start color let this be okay let it be double e double f double e this will be greenish color next i will set the end color and let this be okay let it be double c and double e and again double d so this looks like some gradient next i will set the angle so let the angle be 30 okay if i set the angle to 90 you can see it has changed so i'll set it to 45 here next i will set the gradient radius to 30 dp and i'll set the type to linear if we set it to sweep it is not looking good so i'll just set it to linear and now i'll close this gradient now for rounded corners i will add this corners and here you can add all the radius like the bottom radius let it be 30 dp okay this is only one radius next the top left radius bottom left was 30 dp top left 30 dp top right is also 30 dp and bottom right now i will just change this to 10 dp so now you can see that the bottom right radius is not 30 dp okay but let's make it simple let's make all of them 30 dp next i will set the stroke for stroke we have to set the width let this be 2 dp and we have to set the color so i'll set the color to green color which is double zero double f double zero so this is the stroke so that's all the other options which are available here are solid and 
corners gradient solid size and padding so you can add the solid size and padding also but here i do not require it so now i will use it as background of some views this is background.xml now i'll go to the layout file here i have fragment one in fragment one for this text view i can set the background as this add drawable slash background now you can see this text view has a background i can set it as background of this button also background drawable slash background so now you can see okay it the rounded corner super work but the colors do not work here for the button now let's go to some other text view let's go to fragment 3 and here for this text view also i will set the background to this drawable so you can see that this drawable has green background with padding so that's all in this video thank you very much for watching this